Slob Defense, Modern, Chameleon Variation, 5.E3B56.B3. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered Black in the middle game. Both players had a nice end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The move d5 establishes control over the e4 square, frees up the light squared bishop, and builds a presence in the center. The d4 pawn is safeguarded and the knight advances toward the center with nf3. nf6 controls the e4 square and defends the d5 pawn. c4 gains space on the queen's side, prepares to develop the knight to c3, and invites black to give up control of the e4 square after dx c4. When c6 is played, the d5 pawn is supported and the queen can grow on the queen's side. And c3 attacks the d5 square and starts to fight for the e4 square. A6 is a popular move that keeps white guessing where the light squared bishop will develop or if black will play e6. e3 supports the d4 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. b5 takes space on the queen side and attacks the c4 pawn. B3 supports C4 and prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop to B2, where it will sit on the long diagonal. This pins a knight, which restricts its mobility. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is the final book action. This strikes the opponent's bishop. It is quite good. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is excellent. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. It is ideal. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. It is quite good. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This squanders a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This exposes a knight assault. That's good. The knight becomes more active as a result gaining control over more of the board. It is ideal. Castling develops a rook while moving the king to a safer position beyond the board's center. Castling to the same side of the board as your adversary helps you escape some of the attacking that comes with castling to the other side. It is ideal. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. This disregards a more effective approach to link rooks. It is incorrect. It's alright. That's good. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This exposes a pawn attack. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. A superior technique to take an open file with a rook is missed by this. It is incorrect. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. The bishop is now in a secure position. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This seizes a helpless pawn. It is ideal. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is ideal. This is the way to win a pawn. This threatens to win a rook. 
It is best. There was just one smart move to be made. It is incorrect. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. That's good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. This misses a chance to win back a piece. It is incorrect. This evades the check from the pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The pawn that is attacking is now gone. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. It's all right. That's good. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. This threatens to win material. This allows the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. This causes material loss. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is incorrect. This wins material. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to create a passed pawn. It is a great move. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This prevents a rival bishop's check. It is ideal. This wins material. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That pawn was free for the taking. This is the start of the end game and white is winning. It is best. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. It is ideal. This avoids the bishop's check. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. This avoids the queen's check. It is ideal. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. This avoids the rook's check. It's compelled. Therefore, a knight is attached to the king. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is excellent. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered black in the middle game. Both players had a nice end game. 